Sometime later, a new sound in the house brought me slowly back to consciousness. The rain had stopped, but there was something else, a subtle noise pervading the blackness around me. I listened carefully as I came awake, but couldn't pinpoint the source. It seemed to come from all sides and sounded like seething. It can't be ants, I told myself with a nervous mental chuckle. You can't hear ants. Go back to sleep. But the skittering racket continued to grow, and rest was impossible until I settled the mystery. Now, lighting a match in the rainforest wasn't always a simple task, but it had never seemed to take longer as I scratched through half a box of damp sticks. Finally, a light flared up, and I glimpsed something that made me wish I'd never opened my eyes. Army ants, millions of them, blanketing the walls, covering the floor, dropping from the ceiling, and swarming up the bedspread toward me in a teeming mass. Then the match went out. It was a classic horror show image in real life, and I reacted with the same let's leave the weapons here and split up logic that dooms so many movie characters. Without even pausing to think, I let out a yell, grabbed the nearest lantern, and leaped out the window in my underwear.